This conference will now be recorded. Hello everyone. Welcome to BISP Solutions. Myself Sachin. I am working as a Salesforce consultant and today I am going to show you data sorting using wrapper class. So this data sorting technique is used to sort data ascending or descending order alphabetically. So we can in this way we can implement sorting. So it will help to visualize our data in more better way. So to implement this, I use wrapper class. So first we will understand what is wrapper class. Then I will show you about code. Yeah. yeah. Wrapper class in Apex Salesforce. A wrapper class or container class is a class, a data structure or an abstract data type which contains different object or collection of object as its members. So we can wrap different objects types or any other types in a wrapper class. So since it acts as a data structure, we can format our data in different different way according to our need. So that's why we can use wrapper class. So this was all about wrapper class. Now I'm going to show you what I'm going to create. I'm going to my org yeah this uh, i used uh, yeah in this way i'm going to perform sorting so suppose we we have to uh, we have to see data according to our uh, in alphabetically so in this we can perform sorting in columns of uh, lightning data table in this way yeah and I implemented this functionality using Aura component. So we can we can create our Aura component by going to this. In developer console, our Aura component is available. Yeah, this developer console. As soon as you will click on this developer console, it will open this interface like this yeah sort in component in this way so to implement this first of all i created one component with the name sortable account table dot cmp look its extension is dot cmp yeah and i with aura component i created one apex class its name is sortable account table controller in this way so this I created this apex class, this one, this apex class, in this way. In this in apex class, I use this some uh, objects as uh, this public class account wrapper, and I use public string message, and this and all these uh, elements are aura enabled. In order we can use from our uh, lightning component smoothly and in this apex class i created one uh, method its name is get accounts and this method is also decorated with at the rate aura enabled so we can call this method from our aura aura functionality smoothly without any uh, without any problem in this way so this is our apex class yeah, we can call this apex class from our lightning component so this is our lightning component and lightning component is also known as aura aura in salesforce in this way so in aura component i am going to call this apex class its name is sortable account table controller in this way i am going to mention descriptions and it will available in or all, all pages in home pages record pages and all pages here i am going to define aura handler as soon as our page this record page or home page is about to retrieve on web browser it will call this method on init and this method i am going to create in this controller dot js file javascript file in this way and i am going to uh, set the columns of lightning data table here and I'm setting this sortable is equal to true. So in this way, we are able to perform sorting. 
moreover i am going to define some attributes also one first one attributes for column second one when we are going to fetch the data this account data attribute will help us sort by this attribute it will help us means sort sort by and sort direction means ascending descending and this sort by means it is um, uh, it, it is going to sort by name address number of employees like this then i created one lightning data table and uh, all these attributes are associated with this the property of lightning data table this column this one will holds the column of lightning ta data table and this one is capture the data and then sorting will get performed and as soon as we are going to click on the header header of lightning data table it will perform sorting and this uh, method i am going to mention in this way handle sort i will show you debugging also so in this way you can understand how we are going to perform the sorting and how data is getting flow from one one scripting file to another script file and how data is getting passed in this way this handle sort method i am going to borrow yeah and inside this handle sort this one method in helper helper file sort data is also available this one is helper file this sort data in this way that data is getting sorted and in this method on in it this get account data is also getting called this method is available in helper file so it will call our apex uh, method of apex class in this way and whatever data it will fetch that data is uh, associated in this v account data attri attribute and this account data attribute is associated with our lightning data table and our lightning data table will get populate yeah. so yeah and in apex class i am going to i set some checkpoints here so in this way we are able to uh understand means debug our apex class also so as soon as we created this component in yeah this sort application lightning application is also available and i call this lightning application in this way see this is a standard name space and this this is our component name sortable account table this sortable account table and we can call this component in our application and we can preview this and update preview but we are not going to open in this way we are going to call this component in our uh, record page in our app builder so this is the not uh, right way now i am going to show you yeah this is going to create and we in app builder we can call this our component simply drag and drop um, functionality so this is our functionality we implemented look this uh, sorting it was sorting is working properly in this way. so now i'm going to perform the debugging just right click uh, on this click on inspect then go to source in this lightning page here component in lightning page component or module here our uh, this is javascript file is available our javascript file is sortable accountable.js then we need to click on pretty print in this way now i am going to show you how it is retrieving the data in this way Uh, we can simply we can set the debug points in this way wait a minute just right click on this 
inspect go to source just set debug point in this way and or, or go to pretty print also in this way again refresh this yeah in through this uh, arrow button we can move ahead yeah it's uh, it is calling at account data this method Wait a minute, it is going to other files also. Right click, click on inspect, go to source. We can set a debug point in this here also, in this way. Now I'm going to refresh. yeah it is calling helper get account data this one is our get account data and it is calling get accounts this uh, uh, method we already write in our uh, apex class this one is our apex class so this get accounts this one method it is going to call then we are going to move this action uh, and q what is going to so in this way yeah this one this where is state response if it is success means connection between our uh, javascript class and our apex class is established successfully this is state is successful then this uh, where account wrapper response dot get return value means it is whatever data is fetched it is going to yeah in account it comes inside this variable yeah and what data we are going to fetch this in v account this attribute it is this attribute is getting populated yeah in this way in this way data is getting populated yeah in this way now as soon as we are going to perform sorting then click on inspect again go to source yeah then we can also one more thing we can perform debugging using our aura when we are going to uh, yeah this one right click then inspect then go to source pretty print or as soon as i am going to click on name this sort data this function will get invoked where data 
yeah here data it will show sort direction yeah data is in this way yeah. in this way we can call the function is data is getting it is capturing the data and this v account data it is getting populated in this way yeah so i hope you understand all the process this was all about sorting in lightning data table if you have any more queries regarding to salesforce or any salesforce programming you can drop email on this email id supported bispetrainings.com or you can call on this mobile number also 9826174092 so i hope you like my video thanks for your timing bye bye